Conquering Yourself, a Psychological Analysis. The quote, if you don't conquer yourself, you will be conquered by yourself, is a powerful reminder of the importance of self-mastery. It is a truth that has been recognized by philosophers and psychologists for centuries. Self-mastery is the ability to control one's thoughts, emotions, and behaviors. It is the ability to choose how one reacts to situations and to live in accordance with one's values. There are many benefits to self-mastery. People who have mastered themselves are more likely to be successful in their careers, relationships, and personal lives. They are also more likely to be happy and fulfilled. However, self-mastery is not easy to achieve. It requires hard work and dedication. It also requires a willingness to face one's own weaknesses and to confront one's own demons. Here are some tips for conquering yourself. Become aware of your thoughts and emotions. The first step to mastering yourself is to become aware of your thoughts and emotions. Once you are aware of your thoughts and emotions, you can begin to understand them and to control them. Identify your triggers. Everyone has triggers that can cause them to react negatively. Once you know what your triggers are, you can start to develop strategies for dealing with them in a healthy way. Challenge your negative thoughts. When you have a negative thought, challenge it. Ask yourself if the thought is really true. If it is not true, let it go. Develop positive coping mechanisms. Everyone needs healthy coping mechanisms for dealing with stress and difficult emotions. Some healthy coping mechanisms include exercise, meditation, and spending time in nature. Be patient with yourself. Self-mastery takes time and effort. Don't get discouraged if you don't see results immediately. Just keep practicing and eventually you will reach your goals. Here is a psychological analysis of the quote, if you don't conquer yourself, you will be conquered by yourself. The quote can be interpreted in many different ways. One way to interpret it is that if we do not learn to control our own thoughts, emotions, and behaviors, they will control us. This can lead to a number of problems, such as addiction, depression, and anxiety. Another way to interpret the quote is that if we do not learn to accept ourselves and to love ourselves unconditionally, we will always be striving for something that we cannot achieve. This can lead to a sense of emptiness and dissatisfaction. Finally, the quote can also be interpreted as a reminder that we are all responsible for our own happiness and well-being. If we want to live happy and fulfilling lives, we need to take control of our own minds, bodies, and spirits. Conclusion Conquering yourself is not easy, but it is worth it. People who have mastered themselves are more likely to be successful in all areas of their lives. They are also more likely to be happy and fulfilled. If you are struggling to conquer yourself, there are many resources available to help you. There are books, articles, and websites that can teach you about self-mastery. There are also many therapists and counselors who can help you to develop healthy coping mechanisms and to overcome your challenges.